Welcome back. In this Python tutorial, we are going to go over how to use the OpenPyXL package to insert, delete, and move rows and columns with LibreOffice Calc. The examples shown will also work with Excel and Numbers, etc. When we make a change to the worksheet using OpenPyXL, we will save the workbook and use Reload from LibreOffice Calc to make the updates. For the imports, we have from OpenPyXL import workbook. First, we create a workbook and grab the active worksheet. Next, we are going to append some data to the worksheet using worksheet.append. To save the workbook, the code is workbook.save. Put in the path with the Excel SX extension. To insert rows, we can use worksheet.insert rows. We will insert five rows starting at index one. And here we have inserted five rows. To insert columns, worksheet.insert calls, short for columns, can be used. One column will be inserted at index four. And here we have inserted the column. Now let's go over how to delete rows and columns. To delete rows, we can utilize worksheet.delete rows. In this example, we will start at index 9 and delete two rows. And we can see that rows 9 and 10 were deleted. If we want to delete columns, we can use worksheet.delete calls. Here we will delete one column at index 3. And we can see that column 3 was deleted. Finally, let's cover an example where we move a range of cells. We will move the cell range up 5 and to the right 2 by using worksheet.move range with cell range A6 through E8. And we assign negative 5 to the rows and 2 to the columns. And here we can see the range of cells has been moved. That's all we have for this tutorial. Join us again next time.